Over to Energy Singularity. We're looking at Ewald Hesse with Grid Singularity. Across the room. Good luck. You have two minutes. Um, hi. Um, as Cindy from Vattenfall already said it, uh, we are in the middle of an uh, energy revolution. Uh, what's actually happening is the value is going from the industry to the final consumer behind the meter. Um, now, the regulation is not made for that, nor is the grid made for that um, type of scenario. Uh, final consumers can't trade with each other, or participating in current markets is impossible because the products are not so small. There is no liquidity for small products. On the other side, envisioning such local markets, or millions of them, um, the grid is facing a lot of problems because it wasn't designed for interaction in all directions. So, um, so it's, it becomes in, inevitable that all of these stakeholders in the energy market, the regulators, the transmission system operators, the DSOs, uh, retailers, final consumers, they all have to come together to, uh, to create the next market design. That's why we call the challenge energy singularity, or as a friend of mine, Ton, he's here, would call it, we are all in. So what the challenge will be is we will have, uh, we actually create a simulation, a digital twin of a couple of communities with real data and in different scenarios of market designs and we will let the, our partners um, create challenges from the DSO perspective, exchange operator, final consumers and actually let the developers figure out the solution in real time and I'm very curious what we will come up for, uh, with. Um, so, um, in the next few weeks, we will uh, design the challenges which are with our partners. Uh, some of them are here. The Dutch DSOs, um, a utility from France, NG, um, a utility from Germany and a utility from Denmark, EV. And then we will be looking for you, um, all the stakeholders, uh, research uh, developers, um, data scientists. Join us in this challenge. We are looking for you. Thank <laughs> you.